the moon, Bob Marley's music, everywhere, all around the world. But Bob was more than just a musician. This movie brings to the world a Bob Marley that not a lot of people know. From the day I born, I never know so much struggle. We tell the story of Bob's life, no more, no more, his music, no and his connection with the people. It was a tremendous honor to help share Bob's story, to have the backing of the family. It was really a blessing. All, right. All the family is glad to be part of this. You tell the friend sides of Bob. Everybody here know the culture, know the vibe. It's a very communal endeavor. One love, one heart, one destiny. My father was a messenger of peace and love. Reggae is a people music. People coming together. At that time, Jamaica was a war zone between two political sides. And so Bob's message became the answer to violence and strife. You can't separate the music and the message. And what is the message? Peace. So we gonna walk. Right now, the world really need a love that's in the music. Right. Bob is such a unifying figure. And he's creating a revolution of love. Reggae ready? music come to unify the people. Are you ready for oh, When we auditioned and I saw Kingsley, he was just in a different level. He represent my father very well. And it was not just about the legend or about the artist or about the singer, but the human side and the emotional side. My life is not important to me. My life is for people. The process of trying to get to know Bob and trying to convey the magnetism of his charisma has been life-changing for sure. No guns can stop this message. I want the world to change. And that time is now. My life is for people, that I can be beneficial to a people. And I hope you like jamming too. In Jamaica, with the support of the Jamaican people, we traveled Bob's journey. Being in the actual places where these things happen is very special. It would be an injustice to not have Jamaica's energy in this film. Just seated in Mount Zion. We shot up and down the streets of Trenchtown to add authenticity. Bob Marley, let him go. Going into Hope Road and seeing where he recorded just activates your imagination. I wanna jump it with you. We shot at Strawberry Hill, a location that played a huge role in Bob's life. And that's where Bob went, and we went too, after the shooting. If you don't play the show, then they win. I'm all right, man. We shot the big concert scenes here that actually took place here. We're creating something special. It's a gift to a legend in his own country. I was there at the One Love concert. My father be my father. I spread a message of love and unity. Yeah! This is all we are, following in his footsteps. Every day in Jamaica was magic in that way. Every we were auditioning and I saw Kingsley, who plays my father. He was the one who kept my attention. Kingsley do a great job in an artful way, not trying to mimic my father. Be right. To be true to who Bob was, how he speaks, how he acts, how he sees the world. I think Kingsley, in bringing that human element, and not just Bob the legend or Bob the artist, but the human side. The emotional side. So much of the world knows Bob's music and knows who he is, but they don't actually know what he went through or like what he was like. Bob is one of the most recognizable faces on the planet. So transforming Kingsley into Bob Marley with real authenticity took a team of people. Reggae music to unify the people. Understanding that the family were going to be involved really brought the film to life. I had access to all these people who were there. There's so many amazing stories. This is 
is a guy from the street. Yes, his lyrics are an open book because he's singing for his life. Kingsley was deeply committed to diving into who Bob was. When I see Kingsley, I see my father. Kingsley embodied the best of Daddy. I trust Kingsley. All of the family and all of the friends who knew him, a contribution to the authenticity. It was priceless. Hope you enjoyed your behind the scenes look. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you here next time. Later.